Hello, um, the purpose of this video is for making sure you know how to do translation in Google Sheet. You don't need to use to translate it. And the second part is how to use those translation for your uh, Google Play app and, and publish those trans um, publish your app with multiple languages. So this one is in English. So the way I did it, all I have to you have to do is copy whatever you're tra translating like um, title B is there and then short description is this and the full description is obviously this. So the, here's a land check which I put it. So because in Google Play, it only allows 50 characters um, in a title and 80 characters in short description and 4,000 character in full description, which you don't need to wear. You can't write more than 40. Probably you can, but it would be insane. Um, yeah, so this one is saying is the length needs to be less than 50. So yeah, and the second one is length needs to be less than 80 or equal to, and this one is 40. So the moment it goes uh, lengthier, or longer than this one then the 50 character is going to tell you length issue so I did it this one so when you're going to do the translation it's pretty easy like go to Spanish like create a different sheet I have already created it but to make the videos shorter and just um, uh, to be focused I, I already created this one so all you have to do is just put title description and whatever is already there probably you don't need to do this one you can also do the same thing is source from from a to um, makes sense okay source from let me a to and copy this now copy the same thing for here as well so i do always get get copy from the english we don't want to translate it so we can understand what um the meaning of this one otherwise is if it's spanish i can't understand it but now uh, there will be someone who can understand it um so here the translation purpose let's come to the focus part um uh, all you have to write a formula which is saying is equal equal google translate and then you have to put the source source is b2 from the sheet english called english it could call something else but this is the source this is basically the sheet name it's not the language name um or you have to put it this and then you have to put the source of your text which is english en you have to put these characters uh if you have to go you can go there and then it can describe the whole thing to you and then the what is the target is spanish es and then you got the spanish translation there as you can see um same you can repeat the same process for short description and full description you got all the details but can you see this one it has a length issues length issues and then this one is good uh it'll be good because it's a four thousand which we can't do it um okay so this spanish is done okay the, there is a problem lengthy shout i will show you how to address these ones shortly and then um here is french okay for french um you all you have to do is literally let me show you this one quickly once you do this one you have to copy the whole thing from here and there okay it's still appearing in spanish you have to change it to french so fr is french uh, so i should do this one i'll just keep it in english so we know what what it means um yeah this one needs to be go to french And this one also needs to be French. Okay. French is done. This is good. There's an issues. Okay. To address this issue, all you have to remove the last character until it comes in, in into the 50 characters. Um, okay. This has been done and showing them how to do the translation. You can use multiple um, multiple languages. You can add Arabic. 
uh, Chinese and whatever you like it and you want to publish it and once you get this translation already so in, in Google Play Store you have to go to your store presence store listing after the store listing you have to go to manage translation and then you have to do is add your own translation once you do add your own translation you have to choose the language at the moment i think i already selected um added uh, french and spanish so i can't add it but assume if you have done the translation for uh, for check so probably just add it and then put copy the description from the google sheet to here and then so on. once you've done it do submit and then you're done and dusted i'm going to remove this translation because i don't have any intention to edit it okay it's been done thanks for listening i hope you learned two things one is how to do the translation quick translation in google sheet it's quite easily i will show you how to do it probably just to make my point um arabic is pretty clear so copy and then from here you can put this one will show you i hope i know the oh yeah it's done look Arabic and then just to make sure I can read this on yeah Arabic is done it doesn't translate anything right in capital which makes sense because capital we don't want to translate so translation is done for this one so so easy as you can see translation and the second part is copy this translation into your Google Play Store listing and publish there and make sure your application can reach to multiple um, for the audience or for the user from multiple countries um, if you have any questions just comments and let me know uh, if it's a good or bad everything is welcome every feedback is appreciated thank you very much